Dude, this is hard pass, Kyle. Oh, this yeah. is hard pass. That's I'm going to give it up. Let's get up into it, man. All right. So, UFC 305. We talked about this before. We we touched on it a little bit, but now the card is ready to go. Yeah, what they, they should have done was put it in uh, Miami because the area code 305. Mm-hmm. But, hey, yeah, you dropped the ball, Dana. So, the early prelims starts with... <sighs> That nigga Stewart Black. <laughs> Stewart, what'd you say? Nicole? I think it is Nicole. Would that be Jesus Aguilar or Jesus? <laughs> 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 it might be, man. <laughs> he is from Mexico. Hey, man, man. His name is Jesus. Jesus, man. All right. I'm going with Jesus. <laughs> I got Jesus. Because of his name. God, dog. <laughs> uh, Song Canine versus Ricky Glenn. I'm going uh, Song Canine. Ricky Glenn. He trashed up, but all right. We'll see. These are quick picks. Uh, Tom Nolan versus Alex Reyes. Alex Reyes. You going Alex Reyes? Alex I think Reyes. I'm going to go Tom Nolan on this one. Shout out to the Australians. This is in Australia, by the way. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, all right. Now we get to the prelims. Jack Jenkins versus Herbert Burns. I'm going Jack. I'm going Jack also. Herbert Burns, I didn't seen him quit too many times to, for me to pick him. I got Jack. And he, he'll be doing well in the fight and then suddenly just quit. You can, you can tell by Jack's face that he been through a lot. <laughs> That's true. He probably chew on rocks. For <laughs> I got Jack. All right. Uh, we got uh, Casey O'Neill versus Luana Santos on short notice. Luana Santos. I love Luana Santos. Uh, when I was doing my casual MMA stuff. She was one of those uh, fighters that I was going to do a fighter to watch video about. Casey O'Neill, she has proved to be not as good as we thought she was whenever she broke the uh, top uh, 15. And Luana Santos is on a hot streak. And I think that there's a possibility that Luana Santos might miss weight. But I do think that she's going to beat Casey O'Neill either way. You never say a girl going to miss weight that disrespectful. Well, guess what? I love Luana Santos and she loves me back. I doubt it. I follow her on Instagram. She follows you back? Possibly. So she don't let you back. She follow me, though. Cow. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Josh, Josh Kalibau versus uh, Ricardo Ramos. I got your boy, Josh. I got Josh Kalibau, too, because the same thing with Kaliba. I mean, not Kaliba, uh, uh Ramos, man. He be quitting. And, and I, I, to his last fight, I watched him. Go for a takedown at an inopportune time and get choked out just because <laughs> he did it. Yeah. I was just bad decisions. He's actually really good, mm-hmm. but he make bad decisions. So yeah, I know a couple. I'm going like Josh Kalibau. Yeah, so. uh Junior Taffa versus Walter Walker. I got Walter. I'm going Walter. That's a weird name. I'm going Walter. I'm not sure on this one. I'm going Walter. I want to believe in a Taffa brother's power. No, nah, you know what? I'm going to take it back. I'm going junior. Yeah, I got to go Volta. You got Volta? Yeah, he averaging four takedowns. We going to see. So I'm going to go Volta. You going to go for a takedown, get his ass knocked out. <laughs> all right, now we get to the main card. Yes, sir. Lee Jing Liang versus Carlos Pratis. I got Carlos. Who you got, though? Carlos is the favorite, man. Go with Carlos. But I would feel, I, I don't think I could live with myself if I don't pick Lee. But see, though, you see Lou from China. They only good at cooking fried rice. They ain't good at fighting. I got Carlos. <laughs> they fried rice be busting trail. All right. Lee in his last fight, I think, was it Daniel Rodriguez? If that was his last fight, I think that he really, I think he won that fight and he got robbed. I think Lee is about to come back with a vengeance. Mm-hmm. And I think Lee is going to win this fight. Lee Jing mm-hmm. Liang. I'm going Lee Jing Liang, the leech. I got Carlos. There we go. All right. Tied to Ivasa versus Jarzinho Rosen Strike. Who you got? Richard already know. Jarzino. Rosen Strike? Biggie yes, boy? Yes, yeah, so. You want to know why? <sighs> why? Richard know why. Dang. Let's go. <laughs> Richard, no why. <laughs> Shout out to Richard. This actually is kind of a tough one for me. I'll, you know what? I'm a, 
I think Ty might be done, man. I think Ty might be done. Mm-hmm. I would love to see him get one more shoe in for the road, but Rosenstrike. You know what? No. Rosenstrike ain't going to take Ty down. So this is going to be a brawl. No, nah, I'm going Ty. You going I'm going Ty? Ty to Ivasa. I think that Rosenstrike ain't going to go for no takedowns. They're going to bang it out. And if he's going to bang it out with Ty, I think Ty could catch him. I'm going Ty to Ivasa. All right. Shoot. Hmm. Mateus Gamrot versus uh, Izzy's homeboy, Dan Hooker. Go ahead first. Gamrot got him. You saying Gamrot? Yeah. I th- I, Dan, Dan Hooker stands a really good chance, especially how lethal he is with his knees. But I think Gamrot is... He 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 he's a he's a top three fighter in the division. So my right my heart is telling me Dan. Mm-hmm. My mind is telling me the, damn right. Yeah. Would you go with your heart or mind? You're supposed to go with your mind whenever you're picking fights like this. I go with my heart sometimes, which is the reason that I pick Lee Jing Yang, and I always usually end up being wrong. <laughs> so I go with my uh, mind picking Gamrot, right. but I want to pick Dan though. Yeah, I think Dan stands a chance, but Gamera, I want to pick Dan. But Gamera, Gamera is too Gamera. good. He, he's too good, and he's too also too bold. I love this one. I got Steve. <laughs> Kai Carter friends versus Steve uh, Ersic. Steve Ersic. I got Steve. I really, you know, I'm gonna be honest. I thought I thought Kai Carter friends was gonna be champion. I thought he was going to beat Brandon Moreno and fight, uh, that was Davidson Figueredo at the time. And he lost to Brandon Moreno. Moreno went on to win That's the title. That's my dog, Moreno. Uh, Steve Ersic. Alexandra Pantoja beat pretty much everybody, including Steve Ersic at this point. To be honest, Steve Ersic won that fight, but they gave it to uh, Pantoja. So I'd imagine that Steve Erzik is gonna beat Kai Car France, but I'm rooting for I'm rooting for you, Kai. But Steve Erzik is really good, man. That's a fact. Steve Erzik, Steve Erzik is really good. There you go. Shout out to Steve. But yeah, that's the cool main event of the evening. Hey, Kai, go get it done. <coughs> but I'm sure Steve's gonna get it done. That's a fact. Uh, now that takes us to the main event of the evening. Yes, sir. It's time! The main If If you guys haven't yet, make sure you, uh, uh, like this video, uh, drop down in the comment sections, drop, you know, your picks, and, uh, subscribe to the channel. That's a fact. I saw somebody do that, so I figured I'd take it. There you go. Uh, Drikas Duplessis yep. versus Israel Adesanya. Now, let me say this before we go any say further. It. His name is Drikas Duplessis. Somebody corrected me in the comments in our last video. Mm. But I can't help myself but call him Drikas Duplessis. Duplessis. Yeah. But his name is Duplessis. Duplessis. <laughs> Plessis. Either way it go. The 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 last the I S and the uh and the end is silent or the I at the end of the name is silent something like that that he said in the something comments. silent they said it in the comments they say you pronouncing Drick's name wrong it's the the one of the letters in the end is silent so it's Duplessis Duplessis yeah but I was pronouncing it Duplessis <laughs> I wouldn't pronounce Duplessis either all right but yeah who you got man I'm going with my uh, heart I got your boy Izzy. First round knockout. No, I got Izzy. It was no thought in that. I just like Izzy more. So Man. I don't I got Izzy. This is hard for me. His his year has been rough. He needs this. Man, his year ain't been rough. The last 365 days. You know, with, <laughs> whenever this fight happened, it's gonna be over a year. Oh yeah? Yeah. But it the last ain't no way. Yeah, let, let's see when he fought Sean Strickland. God, dog, that was a year? Almost, if it's not there yet. My heart. September 9th. Okay, so it won't be a year just yeah, yet. 11 but months. Yeah. Yeah, I got Izzy, man. Yeah. He needs this. He needs it. His past two years has been rough. Man. Don't you say it. There's so much emotion that's going in this. Don't you say in, it. Into this fight. Don't you say it. I don't like. Certain things that Izzy has been saying. 
<laughs> but yeah, if this is which it should be, the Izzy that showed up against Costa, Izzy should win. Duplessis or Duplessis, how that person was telling us to say it. I watched the Robert Whitaker fight again, and he does still do those darting in things. He do he doing much less than he used to, but he does still do it. And I think if he plan if there's a point in this fight that he does it more than once, it's a wrap. Now, looking at the Strickland fight, yeah, it goes to show that he got some strength, stuff like that. That that that's a bad sign. But I think that. Izzy took this year off to make sure that when he goes into this fight, he's injury free. So I'm gonna have to go Izzy. It's a fact. But God, I wouldn't be surprised if Duplessis Duplessis gets it done. Does he have a nickname? Drikus. Yeah. Still Knox. We should give him a nickname. What you want to call him? D- I should, no, I should DDP. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. People call him that. Oh, well. Yeah, people call him that. Still. Y'all heard it here first. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, people call him that, but when they announce his name, is Drika still knocks Duplessis. Yeah. But, yeah, he, yeah, people call him DDP, though. Okay, word. Shout out to him, though. Ah! Uh, but, yeah, yeah. I I, I think I, I really see ways that Drikas can get it done. But I'm going to say Izzy because I think that the time off helped him heal up from, you know, any of the injuries he might have had. And I think that if he can channel the emotion that he had when he fought Costa. Mm-hmm. You think he got it? That, that, that he, could, he, could, he could probably neutralize Drickus. Yeah, I think Izzy going to uh, take take a loss, but I'm, I'm rooting for him. So I got Well, him. why you ain't say him. that? Because I want him to win. So but, I'm going to say he going to win. But people look at our videos and bank on us telling them the right picks. They don't bank on us telling us. They don't bank on us telling them who we want to win. They bank on us telling them who we think is going to win. So I can't say I think Izzy going to get knocked out. Well, I think Izzy going to lose, but I want him to win. I you you can say Izzy. that. Yeah. Yeah, I think Izzy going to lose. Okay. But I want Izzy to win. There you go. Okay. So, therefore, okay. I'm saying Izzy going to win. Okay. All right. Yeah, drop down in the comments. Let us know who y'all got for UFC 305. <sighs> I could see Drick is getting it, but I'm I'm thinking Izzy's going to pull it out. If Izzy lose, mm-hmm. I'm giving up on him. Yeah, if he lose, his uh, career is, 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 his prime is done. He going to be in the same category as T-Rex. Dang. I wouldn't put him that far. <laughs> I was about to say, hold up. No, <laughs> the way T Rex got finished yeah, in his last couple of fights was uh, pretty yeah, rough. Shout out to At least Izzy boy. lost by decision. Yeah. <laughs> and the the time that he did, you know, get TKO by Alex, he went the whole fight with him, and he was winning. It, so. Yeah. But uh, yeah, drop down in the comments. Let us know what y'all got, and we'll see y'all soon. Yes, sir. Bye.